We saw in the previous video how to make the search by the query or the name of the movie. In this video, we are going to make a search by the ID of the movie. Before we start coding, I would take 20 seconds to thank all honest people who support us by commenting on most of our videos. And I'm really proud of being like a family in this channel. Every single comment and like will push us making new courses and tutorials. Come on, my friend, help this channel to continue its production by subscribe, like, and leaving a comment. We are going to introduce and learn about the queries and the functionality and the uh, and the parts of the query with retrofit. I'm using the white uh, screen, the white uh, theme in Android Studio because I have updated the Android Studio for 4.1. Okay, so this is the movie ID 550 and this is the API key. We are copying it and I'm going now to paste it this here and the api.movie.org this is the constant and uh, this is the relative url from three to the last of the url we have two two variables the id of the movie and the api key for that we go to the movie api and we put here the get method so we are going to use this link in order to get the movies having the ID that we will pass later on in the main uh, on the movie list activity. We start by get and we are going to get here the three. This is the link. Copy it and because ID here is variable I will replace it with movie ID and between brackets between uh, these brackets now the movie ID here is variable and I uh, I uh, follow it by question mark because question mark you can uh, also retrofit will add it but the, it is good to put it after the before the query so i will make the same as before a call of having the movie model okay and making a method called get movie and i need to to pass the parameter first of all the path and second the second parameter is the api key first of all is path and the second is the query here is the trick so it's very important that you make the movie i underscore id the same as it is uh, passed in the path query okay so movie i movie id should be the same as above now i move to the api key as we see before i will make a query and passing the api underscore key okay and because it is a string called API key and I will close this in this way we have configured the interface and the get method for the movie API okay guys so remember that the movie ID uh, for equal to 550 is uh, for uh, Jack Reacher or maybe the Fight Club but uh, we will see later in, uh, when we make the test for and the run for the app but till now back to the movie list activity we are going to create a um, private void method which is uh, named as get retrofit response from uh, or according to the movie id so this method will help us getting the id or and the movie according to its id so get retrofit response according to id okay and in the same way as we have done before we are going to make the requests by starting by with a movie api and this is the interface and making an 
instance of it service dot get movie api okay in this way we are calling the retrofit and we start by retrofit calls second is call movie model we are passing and we need uh, to get a call of type movie model having all or uh, of this data or the movie data that we are going to parse later on so we get movie and i will pass the movie id 550 so i need to get i'm making this uh, a method in order to test my uh, retro retrofit request so i'm passing the 550 as an id for my movie in order to sh to see if i will get the title of this movie or not so i'm just testing for the success of the retrofit uh, response call so response call dot nq the same way on response i will make the check for if, for the code if it is 200 so 200 as i told you and as the documentation on our application found um, master coding you can check them onto the play store uh, you can download it this is our official application we have uh, all these tutorials uh, written uh, you can download it free so go to section uh, retrofit and http response and you will find that 200 uh, is the success uh, code uh, for uh, rest apis and uh, call and response from http calls okay so it is if it is success go and make a tag and uh, go uh, tag me for the rest the response of the movie and the response would be the title of the movie let's get the title of the movie having a movie id equal to 550 okay guys so this is what we are going to test and we are going to see okay guys and let's make and the else statements for and we make the try and catch clauses okay so inside the try we are going to make the connection and see if the connection uh, if it is uh, false or not having connection so the error would be uh, printed in the tag and having the response dot error body and so the error uh, body will be printed and here we have the red line because we need to make the catch surround by catch close okay Till now we have finished the uh, requests and the making the uh, ID and the response according to ID. Sorry, my kid is uh, trying to use retrofit and <laughs> he's screaming. Now uh, get retrofit response according to ID. Now let's call the button and let's run it. So we see we need to reinstall the and restart the application okay and we have here the tag let's click the bottom and here we go we get the response so the name of the movie having id 550 is fight club it's not uh jack reacher let me see let me correct here okay so i will type here the uh, id of the fight club this is the response and let me check yes it is for fight club it's not for uh, jack richard so 550 is for ja uh, for fight club let me correct this now let's check for the jack richard id okay I will give you the ID of uh, Jack Reacher. Now, the ID, I think, 343. Let me go back here. This is for Jack Reacher. 
and here it is three four three and six one one let's run this is the id okay let's click the button okay and here we go the response is working fine thank you guys